Channel 2 Investigates has been on top of the legal battle over Harris County Judge Lena Hidalgo's order to release some county jail inmates due to concerns about COVID-19. Today we learned one inmate who was released over those concerns is now back behind bars. Channel 2 Investigator Robert Arnold is live in Northwest Houston tonight. And Robert, you just spoke with Judge Hidalgo about this case. What did she say? I did, Chris. First, I'm going to start with some numbers. 100 sheriff's office employees have now tested positive for COVID-19, 85 of whom work in the jail. 71 inmates have also tested positive for the virus. We did have several questions for Judge Lena Hidalgo. Our main question, however, was does the county have a set plan to manage this problem? What the health experts have told us is to be able to be in a position where we're safe, we need to have the jail population around 5,000. To hit that number, the county would have to release around 2,500 inmates. And so far, county officials have been at odds over exactly who to release from the jail. Judge Lena Hidalgo's initial order to release certain nonviolent inmates was blocked by felony court judges. Sheriff Ed Gonzalez then asked a federal court judge to settle the matter. The judge ruled she would not intervene, writing, a federal district court asked to wade into policy and political disagreements among state and county elected officials is in risky territory. Hidalgo says the county did look at transferring inmates to facilities out of the area. Not surprisingly, they were denied. In many ways, each man for himself with this. Each community is trying to figure out what to do with their incarcerated population. What about constructing a temporary building? It wouldn't have met the uh, jail standards for the level of even a minimum security jail. Hidalgo says the plan now is to transfer 80 healthy inmates to an empty juvenile detention facility and another 600 to a third jail that is empty but in need of repairs. And those repairs will take three weeks. Further clouding the issue is one of a handful of inmates released under Hidalgo's initial order has already been arrested again in facing two new felonies. We don't make policy according to headlines. I, 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 you can't be 100% certain of everything. We'd have to arrest everybody in Harris County to make sure nobody's going to get in any sort of trouble. As for any further legal action on this front, Judge Hidalgo says she does not plan to go that route for further, for fear of further delaying the process. The Harris County District Attorney's Office did report, though, that out of the initial 1,400 names considered for release, 372 of those inmates have been released. The DA's office, however, did object to the release of more than 1,000 of those inmates. Reporting live from Northwest Houston, Robert Arnold, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Robert, thank you.